Welcome to the finale of the Dead Man Mode tournament. Three weeks of grinding and straight PKing all leads up to this. Now this finale is a little bit different to the ones you may have watched before. In previous tournaments, the finale included a 1v1 stage. And before all that, it was a multi-only final on one world where the last man standing wins. This tournament, however, has completely removed the final 1v1 stage and gone back to the multi-final endings. And instead of one world, there are five. This means there will be one man standing left on each of the worlds so there will be five winners and different clans will be choosing different worlds strategically in order to try and be the last clan alive on their world. Now I do think this is a bit of an underwhelming way to do the final, especially with five worlds to choose from because it means certain clans can avoid the other clans, stay on a world and get a free win. Now I've been showing you guys nothing but action throughout the tournament and that won't change here. My team Tata is allied with Rot and we're going to follow the lit element and overtake clan alliance wherever they go and try and fight them so at least we'll have some action. Now apparently there are meant to be bosses from the breach all over the final area and throughout the finale so I'm actually using the sigil of titanium which will reduce attacks from monsters by 60%. I'm using the sigil of the potion monster because it has a 20% chance to not consume my brew or my potion when I drink it. And the sigil of well fed has a 20% chance to gain me twice the amount of hit points from consuming it as well. So it's really just to outlast as long as possible. So here you can see each world has around 400 to 600 people in it, but the lit element and overtake alliance are trying to be in a different world from us. So they keep hopping around and we keep following them. Once the finale officially starts, you can't hop worlds anymore. So we have to be in their world on time. So it was actually a little bit risky to keep hopping around, but we managed to do it and get in their world. As you guys can see, the finale has officially started, meaning once you die, you're permanently logged out and you can't hop worlds anymore. And World 409, the world we settled on, has over a thousand people in it. Now between the 30 Tata members, the 30 EX members, and the 120 Rot members that make up our team, we have around 200 out of that 1,000 people. The Lit, Element, and Overtake guys make up around 300 of the 1,000 people. And the other 500? are all with Iliop14 and his open stream team, so this world is easily going to have the most action. The finale for this world was going to be in Falador Multi, so we slowly made our way over there. Now it seems the breaches weren't actually going to be in the final area. A couple of them popped up on the way there, but they were also super underwhelming and there wasn't too many breaches or too many bosses. We got situated right north of the Falador Wall, ready to run into Multi and the final area when the fog started hitting us. And that's when we got word that the lit, Element and Overtake Alliance joined Iliot 14 CC to ally against us. This means it was now R200 versus all of their combined 500 to 600 people. Lit, Element, Overtake, and the Iliot 14 stream team versus us. <laughs> okay, okay, good, good, good. Yo, yo, we just got- we just got an influx of soldiers! <laughs> With their new numbers, Lit Element and Overtake felt pretty confident, and they rushed on top of us spamming stuff like sup pussies and started to hit us in single to try and drain our supplies. Yeah, we're gonna wipe them. This is Eliop, Overtake kids. Stay ragging on anybody. Right click and get on a 90, like a lower level if you guys are in good gear, so you don't have to worry about it. There's low- low levels in this shit. Right click yo. and just hit in singles. We are pre-type, we all know how this ends. Everybody pre-type. I'm gonna give us like 10 seconds. I'm on the big spin. Pre-type, we all know how this ends. <laughs> Alright, five, four, three, two, one. Go. Perfect. And pull, pull whatever emoji you guys want. Peace money. Winky <laughs> face. Yeah. Winky face. So the clans have to have their little cringe spam wars, but as this is happening, the clock is ticking down and we are getting pushed into the center of Falador. Just stay ragging, the ragging in singles. You rag back. That's what we do. One flag spread, chill, just chill. Yo, this is mad easy. Yo, just keep bolting single PK yeah. these kids, bro. They're garbage. They're fucking. No, they're trash. all noobs. You stay on and hit names. They have yeah, to hit. go multi, or if not, they fucking they die. They lose, bro. We kept getting pushed from single closer to multi, and they just kept spamming at us while in single. But we were actually killing a couple of them in single. And then the fog started hitting us more and more damage, which means it's time to run into the center. It's time to run into multi, and the multi fight is about to start. I promise you. We hey, gotta hey, be in multi, we gotta get a multi. Come west, boys. come west with the boys, come west, come west with the boys. Come west, come west, we gotta run in west. Don't get hit if you're in west. Stay far west, run in, run in. They're, they're gonna get clumped. Stay some, stay some. Now, I'm not gonna lie to you, my point of view for this multi fight may seem a little bit pussy, and that's because it is. 
I don't really want to be the one rushing in the front because they have 500 people. If it comes down to a close fight, I want to save my supplies. Just catch freezes on them, bro. Try to get in a box. Try to get them in boxes. Freeze them in Be boxes. on the southeast Northeast side, guys. Barrage on northwest. Be south yeah, southeast. Southeast, yeah. barrage on northwest. You're right? the middle. Look at the box. He's the middle. Look at the box. He's the statue. Yeah, the box. The box. Yeah, southeast corner, northeast side. There's a bunch. Keep you guys can barrage west. Southwest. There's a bunch of noobs like from that open CC. Barrage, oh, barrage west. Guys. Barrage west, boys. Barrage west. Everyone. West. Everyone. Just stay on the southeast side, though. Stay on the side. Stay close to us. Don't 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 far out too much. Barrage West. Barrage, barrage West. South of Valley entrance right now. South of Valley entrance is about Bro, 40 people. Barrage, south, south, of Valley, south, south of Valley. South of Valley. South of Valley right now. Barrage deck. South of Valley? They're in a box. Oh West, my West, God. Team. Oh my oh, God. God. Oh my oh, God. 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 How do you win? How do you win? <laughs> you, dude, I hate that. There's 80, 80 people there, bro. Yo, pre-tap. Ha, 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 ha. With fours. H4, H4, H4. Pre-tap that. Pre-tap that. Pre-tap that. Pre-tap that. Keep barraging it. Keep barraging it. Keep barraging it. Don't run it. Don't run it. Don't run it. Three, two, one. Spam. 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 Go, go, go. H2, yep. Good spam, good spam, good spam. No. I guess just squaz the entrance, boys. Just squaz the entrance. Get near the... Get in safe zone, by the way. Get in safe zone, get in safe zone. There's a... It's just purple dots. You guys can come to safe zone. Honestly, just go south of uh, the... South of the statue. Restock on food. Restock on food right now. There's food north and shit. There's food north. You need to come in. Restock. Get your fucking food stock up before we like actually fight. I mean, that might be the fight. No cap, bro. That might be it. That might be the final. <laughs> that, that was it. Just start hitting names single. Northwest side. Northwest side. We got a little team. We got a little team. Northwest side of the Fally statue. They're running in. Litman names and shit like that. Litman names. Hit Northwest. Northwest. They're in a box as well. In a box. Going to ta Taverly. Get in the center of statue, uh, Fally statue and Barrage Northwest. Get in the center of the Fally statue, Barrage Northwest side. All up there. Northwest side. You can guzz it out. HP's high. HP's high. HP's high. Be eating up. Eating up. Stay moving, stay moving, stay moving. Yo, hit any names inside, any names you guys can, like any white dot names. Uh, just try to single pile for right now. We got a lot of people southwest side and uh, southeast, I mean northwest. Southwest and northwest, barrage there. Get in the center of the Fally statue and just be barraging. We have so many people. We got a Litman guy all the way east inside of us if you, got, if you catch it. He's 111 combat, uh... I put it at signs. He's legit at- Focus northwest, guys. Focus he's dead, northwest. he's dead, he's dead. Okay, dead. Focus, Focus yeah, multi for right now. We'll do single soon. Barrage Northwest Don't be scared, guys. I promise you guys won't die. Go, go Northwest, Barrage Northwest. Barrage, you were killing them all. They're actually just wiping them all. Southeast and Northwest. Southeast and Northwest. Yeah, kid, they're still Northwest. They're still Northwest. There's a fat clump. Yeah, quite of them. Yeah, on the west, right. west side of the statue right now, Barrage it out. West side of the statue, a lot, a lot, a lot. There's like 10, 15 people right now, west side of the statue. Just pre barraging it out. Blood Barrage the whole time. Blood Barrage the whole time. Lots of people south. You guys can barrage south too. Barrage south too. Come a little bit okay. more south. Barrage south. Barrage south. Barrage south. They're directly south of the statue. Just keep guazing them out. Eventually they're going to die out. There's just a lot of them. Barrage that out southwest. Or south actually. Just south. South of the statue. South of the statue. Keep barraging that shit. Keep barraging that shit. Keep barraging that shit. Keep barraging that shit. They're still there. There's, there's like fucking 500 people. We're just clearing them out. They're a bit southwest now. If you guys want to come southeast, come southeast. Just barrage west. Care about barraging your teammates. Southeast, you guys can barrage west. Southeast, keep barraging west. Keep barraging west. Keep on the, keep on the, either go in the middle of the statue or southeast, barrage west. One of the two, one of the two guys, keep barraging this shit, keep barraging this shit. Don't get caught around the gates though, don't get caught around the gates. Keep barraging west, We're keep gonna barraging west. Like, HP side. Keep HP high, just barrage west, it's pretty simple. Flick don't your ropes, flick your ropes, yeah, flip your, if you guys have a mage ropes, be barraging in that, flick your tank. This is an easy guaz, bro, easy guaz. We're on the east side right now, we're barraging west. There's white dots inside, spam TA name, spam EX name, spam rot name, one of the two. Keep barrage that shit west. Northwest, guys. Northwest. Come northeast now and barrage west. Come northeast, barrage west. They're just going to keep rotating north and south. They don't know That's where to go. Do. They're gonna yep. south. Come northeast now, barrage west. Until they until they run south again. Come northeast, barrage west. Keep barrage that shit west. Fat clumps. Fat fucking clumps. They're still going to clear it out. There's fat fucking clumps. Fat clumps. Fat clumps. There's like 10 people. Honestly, don't even eat food. Just blood barrage that shit. You don't even need to yet. Yeah. Legit. Oh my god, these kids again. Fuck. They're dropping good fights, you know? I respect no, that. True. Don't fuck with us. Don't. Don't I see Storm's 100k us. all the way west. That's a lit kid. Oh. Care Barrage, that rock guy in there. They're in a big clump northwest. I'm fucking. Yeah, that, that clump got glossed. Alright, uh, just stay stay north of the statue right now until they, until they rotate again. They're like killing themselves, and obviously we got like some suicide bombers in there. 
Bro, just actually. Ancestral Arcane? What Bro, the it's, fuck? It's 186 out of, we're 186 out of 262, by the way. When we're 186 out of we're 262. We're fucking winning this, 100%. This is an easy keep quest. Keep barraging on the west side. West side, keep barraging. Just dip in and out. Dip in and out. Go, like, northeast, you know what I mean? Barrage uh, that southwest corner. Try to get in the middle of the uh, Fally statue and be barraging. We're going the south side. Barrage southwest. There's so many of them in the trees. This is actually free. There's 239 people left, bro. This is an easy win. Holy fuck, bro. No way we have this many left. I didn't take any damage. I don't know about you guys. Start what looting, bro. Yo, hey. I'm so, yeah. We had 200 people versus the 800 other people in this world. And I actually promised you they were all allied together. They were all in Iliot 14 CC and they're all together. Lit, Element, and Overtake. I got to give a shout out to the Rot multi cladding people because they did a really good job and i basically if you guys just watch my point of view i basically attacked three or four people i afk'd throughout the entire thing and we still <laughs> we still managed to clear everyone and the last 200 people were all in our cc we actually managed to fall in because we were the last ones alive after cleaning out a huge alliance but this is kind of what i mean with it being underwhelming they were the only ones we could fight because we were chasing them around the, hop the worlds that they hopped and that means four other clans and four other worlds were completely free of our team and the alliance we were fighting. It means everyone else on a different world got free wins without any competition on those worlds. And if it was all on one world, then all of those other clans on the different worlds like Blazers and stuff would have had to join the fight too. And it would have been more competitive and there would have been less alliances. Now remember Tata only had 30 people out of the 200 left. And once it was just us left, it was a free for all between us. And I tried my best to blood barrage but Rock killed us all too, and they ended up winning quite easily, with this guy having quite a collection of items in his inventory, like an Ellie and a bunch of other shields. But yeah, that is officially a wrap on the Ditterman mode content. I would really advise you to watch my point of view of this tournament from the start. I've linked the first episode down below in the description. The tournament lasted 21 days, and this is officially my 21th video of the tournament, so I'm really happy with the work I've done. The month was a lot of fun, but the 20 finale was really underwhelming in my opinion, and I have a lot of feedback for it and the tournament in general. So let me know in the comment section any questions or suggestions or what you want to know from me regarding future Deadman Mode tournaments. And I might make a whole video giving my feedback and suggestions on my second channel, which is linked down below too, so that we can help make the next Deadman Mode a lot better than this one. Apart from that, thank you guys for watching every single video and supporting me. It means a lot to be able to do this as my full-time job, as well as literally get sponsored by Jax to play Deadman mode is a dream come true. So big thank you to Jax in general for hosting it in the first place. Subscribe if you're new, and I will see you guys later.